Good morning, everybody. It's Ramona. Welcome back. It is Schlumpy Saturday, as you can see. Uh, I did not get gussied up because after this, I'm going to do some derma rolling and masking, and uh, so that's why I look like this. Um, so I have a candle haul here for Marshall. So I went out to breakfast. Um, it's just like a little tuckeria place, so it's not a fancy joint. You just get up and go. And we, I went with my coworker friend, uh, Marcella. I don't think Marcella watches me, but if you do, hi. And um, then she said, well, let's go to Marshall's, which happens to be right across the street. So I knew in my head, there's no walking out of Marshall's without making a purchase. Like, okay, let's go. So we did. So I did do pretty well. So my goal was, um, my ultimate goal was not to purchase any candles, but we all know that, that wasn't going to happen. So my true goal was to purchase candles that I've not burned before to kind of expand our horizons. You know, it's always, you know, Yankee Homeworks, Bath and Body Works, not in that order, but there's lots of other brands out there. So let's try some, I thought. So we are. So let's get started. I did buy one non-candle thing, which was this Philosophy gift pack. Uh, it's peppermint stick, bath and shower gel, and a lip gloss as well. It's supposed to be $20, and I got it for $4.50, so that's a good deal. And I do love Philosophy shower gels. That's what I use in my shower. Okay, and the rest are candles. All of these are new to me brands except one which is this one and it i thought the brand was fine quality but when i look on the bottom it's dw home so this is spiced current and i'm just going to do some cold sniffs now i am going to review each one of these individually and then we'll go through the official scent notes and you know burns and all that kind of stuff um so right now i'm only talking about cold sniff that's it i have no idea how these candles are going to burn also what I think I'm going to do is there's six candles here and uh, I am going to make it interactive and the first person to respond which to pick which candle I will burn first and then we'll go to on that week and then I'll have my review next week for that and we'll pick another one like that. Kind of like we do Sensi Saturday and Walmart Wex Wednesday. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, Spiced Current and I was really caught by the packaging. I really love this box. It's kind of like a faux velvet kind of dealy thing with some gold and anyway, it's very, very, very pretty. It's a one wick candle and it is, uh, it's covered up by the price. It is 7.3 ounces and I got this on sale for $4 on clearance. And it is a, a tart a tart, I'm getting a tartness from it. Not super strong. On cold, I would say five out of 10, so we'll kind of wait and see how that burns. It's a pretty burgundy glass, and it has one wick, and it's pretty well centered there as well. So that's number one, DW Home Spiced Current. Uh, number two is a new to me brand called the Sutton Lodge and this is in white pine. This was $3.50 and oh, this is from, oh, okay, sorry. It's not, the brand is not Sutton Lodge. My apologies. Maybe that's the collection, I guess, because it's a DW home. I didn't see that. I'm sorry. 18.14 uh, 18 18 ounces in the scent white pine. Oh, and this is a wood wick candle. And I've never had a wood wick candle. And actually, I was just gifted a couple of wood wick candles, which I'm going to uh, probably do. It was a Christmas gift from a friend. I'll, we'll get into it. Also light. I do smell the pine. Again, I'm going to say it's on cold, a 5 out of 10. So if you want to... Uh, me to choose this one. It is the Sutton Lodge White Pine. Uh, this is new to me and it is from Torched Premium Candles and they're all from like old beer bottles and this one is in Juniper and Woody Pine. Uh, the, I guess the name of it is Pinewood Pilsner and the scent description is Juniper and Woody Pine. It's 11 ounces. And this was four dollars. 
and it's a single wick. It has a nice tall wick. I'll probably trim that down a little bit. It's quite, lar quite long. Mm. Not really smelling too much of anything, actually. So if it doesn't come out on burn, then I've just wasted $4. But we'll see what happens. It says it's an 80-hour burn time. So this is Torched Premium Candles Pinewood Pilsner. Number three is another new to me brand, M of WG, and this is in Seagrass. Uh, it is uh, 5.91 ounces, and this was $5.99. And surprisingly, this was the most expensive candle, even more expensive than that large one. So Seagrass is green sea kelp, wild herbs, marine aldehydes, florals, amber woods, and white musk. This smells really good on cold. And it's probably like a 7 to a 7 to 5, 7.5 on strength. Really nice, very nice bathroom scent. I'm going to uh, burn that in the bathroom. So if you want that one, this is M of WG Seagrass. Can you see that? Kind of. Uh, number five is a Peck Sniffs candle. And I've seen Peck Sniffs in Marshalls before, but I've never burned one. So I thought I'd pick it up since I'm trying to do th different ones. This one is the scent uh, number four, Bourbon and Mandarin. And it is 5.29 ounces. And it was, oh, this one also was $5.99. Upside down it is. Peck Sniffs. Bourbon and Mandarin. Single wick. Kind of, um, not really getting any citrus or mandarin per se. I'm kind of just getting a cologne note. Anyway, we'll see how that goes. Uh, so if you want that one, it is Peck Sniffs number four, bourbon and mandarin. And finally, uh, this has no name on it. There was no, I don't know if the lid is wrong on this but there's no label on the outside. On the underside, it just says, you know, typical burn, you know, burn, keep away from children, blah, blah, blah. It's 11 ounces. The scent is for grapefruit, distributed by MVP Group, which I've heard of lots of candle companies, not lots, but I know can uh, MVP Group, I think, is a common candle distributor is what I'm trying to say. I've heard of it before. But other than that, and under here, those are just price tags, so I don't know who makes this candle. If anybody knows, let me know. But for now, we're gonna call it the plaid candle, okay? And as I said, it's fir grapefruit. Uh, it's also a single wick, nicely centered. And I do kind of get a little bit of fir, and I do get a citrus note as well. So hopefully this will be good. Uh, yeah, so anyway, if you want this one, we're just going to call that the plaid candle. So, um, the whole thing, six candles and the Philosophy Shower Gel and Lip Gloss was, including tax, $32.99. So, I consider that a good deal. Now, if none of them throw and they're all crap, then it's probably not a good deal. But I think it's, you know, a good deal for six candles. That's fine. Um, and the shower gel. So that is it. So as I said, the first person to pick a candle, that will be the one I will burn and review next weekend. And I guess that's it. I'm going to do some derma rolling and masking. Have a great Saturday. I will see you soon. Bye.